Hey what's up guys, Scamfave here and welcome to this week's Team of the Week. It is a very, very good looking Team of the Week and I'm looking forward to trying out a bunch of these players. So, now we're back to a normal schedule, the normal uploads have resumed. In the comments below guys and in the straw poll in the top of the description, let me know which players from this week's Team of the Week you'd like to see me do a player review on. And also guys, while you're in the comment section, let me know, are you going to be opening packs tonight? Are you going to try and pack any of these players? And uh, yeah, which players do you want to pick up? Which players do you want to try out? Let me know in the comments below. So here it is guys, Team of the Week, number 3 of FIFA 16 Ultimate Team. And the first thing you will notice, there's a hero card in there, and that is Hero Lewandowski. But um, you might be wondering, why the hell is he a hero card? And honestly, I don't know, I really thought he was going to be a record breaker card. Anyway, we'll talk more about that Lewandowski card in a moment. Let's have a look at some of the other players in this week's Team of the Week. We've got Kameni in net. Decent looking keeper with some good attributes. He does lack in height in FIFA though, which is a bit of a shame. School actually is next to him. The former Arsenal man gets himself a very nice looking inform. Mustafi, I said in my predictions he was going to get an inform, but um, I didn't put him in my predictions. Silly me, Mustafi gets a very good looking centre-back card. And then you got Manolas. Look at the shooting upgrade he has on his card. I'm pretty sure Manolas... On his normal card has like 18 and 19 shooting. It might even be lower, which is pretty crazy. But he's got 25 shooting on this inform, which is uh, pretty damn interesting. Up next is Alexa Sanchez getting the inform for his hat trick against Leicester. Awesome looking card, 88 pace, 89 dribbling, 86 shooting. Looking forward to trying that card out. Hopefully, it's not too expensive. Let me know your thoughts, guys. Well, how much do you think these players will cost in the comments below? Next to him is another BPL player, Eric Lamella, with some very good attributes. It is just a shame that Lamella no longer has 5-star skills in FIFA, but still a nice looking inform for him. Kazi, the uh, League 1 player on the next row, decent looking card for him. It's a shame he's on the wing. Nolito getting the inform for his good performance against Barcelona. Rafael getting a striker card with 84 passing, 86 dribbling. That is pretty awesome. And then we've got Daniel Sturridge, and I'll be honest, I'm a bit surprised to see this one in Team of the Week, but um, I do understand it did get two very nice goals in um, his return. And uh, awesome looking card, 90 pace, 84 dribbling, 85 shooting. That card looks incredible. Hopefully, going to be able to try that one out. And then we come back to that Hero Lewandowski card, which just looks incredible. 90 shooting and 82 heading. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that heading stat is meant to be physical. But still, the thing that I'm more confused about is, as I say, I thought Lewandowski should have got a record breaker card. But nevertheless, it's awesome that he's got a special card. Onto the bench, Ben Arthur as a cam, definitely going to convert him to a striker to use him, and some other decent looking cards like Kyle Aaron and Jonathan Soriano. Anyway guys, that is Team of the Week 3 of FIFA 16 Ultimate Team. Let me know your thoughts on it in the comments below. Make sure you let me know which player you'd like me to review as well, and I'll see you tonight for some player reviews. Have a good day. Adios.